Okay. Obviously, we are here. <coughs> Hello, Tina. Hello, Pascal. Hello, Gina. Mel. Uh, huh. Yes, we are. Mm, we have some. How do we call it? Uh, I don't have my hello ma'am how is in England so we have uh, rough times here in Slovenia I don't know about you in other parts of the world but we have we have our um, schools closed uh, closed and all all um, okay my tablet is okay now um public um, traffic is Buses don't uh, drive, no trains, no planes, no nothing. We can only go out for the things that are um, necessary or how can I say so. And this is the result. I don't have my binder. I can't go to Austria to Estrai, Austria, <laughs> to buy it, so I will have to use things that I have in my home. So today I mixed my paints with, with glue, my emulsion, so I mixed some of this into it. You don't hear me, Pascal? Do you hear me? Okay. Okay. How is in states with this uh, coronavirus virus? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I hope that it will go okay. Hello, Roxy. Uh, our, um, I don't know, I hope that uh, this uh, situation with this uh, coronavirus will go well, as well it can be, so. Hmm. Yes, here in Europe is uh, critical and obviously all over the world mostly. So we will be online more. <laughs> uh, so um, we don't recommend to be online all day long, but um, our government recommends to contact with people just online. So maybe this, maybe we can join, uh, gather a little more this week or two. I don't know. Maybe I will do some live in the middle of the week too, because a lot of people don't work so we can maybe uh, do some lives and some drink some coffee and chit chat yes roxy it's uh, these are uh cruises are uh, 
yes, we can get together here on YouTube. So, uh, I have mixed my paints with glue, as I said, and consistency is totally different that I'm used to. So, I hope that it will work and I have a plan to do a reverse flower dip on these uh, cups again and then one, re one or two red ring pours. But first I want to do this flower. Uh, and I will use my navy blue for a background and try to do an orange flower on top. And of course I mixed my pearl white because you know what happened last week if you watched my life. <laughs> I missed it so much so today I have it because I'm I think that I need it but I don't know how this will work with this pouring medium so I added about 60% of PVA glue and 20% of my acrylic emulsion and 20% of water for my pouring medium and we will see what will happen so I will start with navy blue background I like this uh, combination of blues and oranges but I mixed quite a few oranges because I couldn't decide which one I want to use uh, but for other oranges I don't know if I will use all of them or just some of them I will do sides a little bit but I can fix it later I don't know how this pouring medium will work we will see Maybe I will not get the effects from my pearl white. I bought my pearl white. Uh, so this one I have on stock. But I don't have my binder. And they don't ship to Slovenia so I can I can't get it until this will be over, so we will have to work with what we have. I have some Vallejo pouring medium and I have some acrylic binder of some other brands, so I will experiment this. 14 days or I hope that it will not last longer because our government can tell us how long this will last but at least 14 days so we will see It's a strange situation you know, here in Slovenia most of people <laughs> buy everything in our grocery stores so uh, I don't work with kinder in kindergarten anymore so but they are closed anyway uh no one will go to work just um, uh, hospitals and this 
other um, services that have to work. So my name is done. I don't know how this will go as a background. I didn't do a navy background before, so uh, and I will of course try to find my center <laughs> as always because I and I will try to do it a little differently. I saw my friend Erica from Erica Art channel. She's Slovene too. Uh, that she did it a little differently and I will try to do it a little different too. So definitely I want to use this um, Conequadone burnt orange and I want to use this um, orange red and of course my pearl white and I will use some reflex orange and maybe just these three these three this time or Australia Copa zdaj fokusira kar naprej Okay, you see this one is reflect orange, how strange reflection <laughs> on the top. So, let's see, and I will add just a tiny bit of blue first. This is the navy blue that I have for my... And then my pearl white. And I will add Sconequadone orange. Sconequadone burnt orange, I should say. And let's add reflect orange next to it. This reddish orange red. And maybe I want another lighter lighter orange here. So this is permanent orange. And the touch of pearl white. My head again. Just to blow this off. And I will do two cups again today because I like the result that I get last time so let's put it down okay and huh no I don't want I will we'll just add this orange conequadon burnt orange oops Yes, this is uh, 20 by 20 centimeters canvas for my flower, but I have 30 by 30 ready for a wrecked ring pour that we will do next. Okay, and Don't have to be here, Kai, eh? Um, 
Kaj sučem? Pa niti nikaj ne. And... Permanent orange. And I will add a little of Indian yellow here in the middle. And this will be it. I'm just blowing my paint uh, if my head was on the way. So this part is done. And now I will and then <clears throat> I will do a reverse dip on top. So I think that my pearl white reacts a little strange. As I said, I don't know how this will work because it's a glue mixture, not my normal pouring medium. Whoops, I have to find my, where is my bottle for spraying napkins here. Hoping that I will not get more <clears throat> tricky to use together, but I hope not. So, okay, and let's spread this out a little bit. lot of paint paint in there okay Let's see. I hope that I will not lift a lot of this blue. Off. With my towel. My hands are shaking today. I didn't do a nice job with this part. But some Things is happening. I get a little of lacing, but different, you see, because and I didn't get the same lacing as I get with my mixture, so I know that I knew that, but. 
as I said I have to use what I have because I don't have my binder my mixture that works the best for me so I will just Try to level this out a little bit. It will be okay when it's dry. So let's storage this and see if we can get something more out of it. Not much. As you can see, Preden sem dipnula. Ja, nisem mogla pustiti. It was too much paint to leave it like it was. So, I will just try to touch the center a little bit. And I don't like this part at all. But how can I fix it without ruining everything? Okay. This is done. I miss a little paint here. <clears throat> So you see, quite different. It reacts really different than my pouring medium. It just doesn't fit here. So it will be tricky today because I'm not in my comfort zone. <laughs> but uh, this blue will dry really, really dark. So uh, I forgot to, to bring my, just a second. Now when I talking about the day will dry <clears throat> dark, I forget to show you the dry results from last week. You see this um, paints gray, it's almost black. So this is the hibiscus flower that we did. And I miss this kind of lacing. <laughs> uh, and the other one, uh, if you remember this one, so as you can see that it dried a little darker, but it's beautiful in uh, person. This one, I love them both. And I want to show you a dry result with my experiment with pearl white and, um, set in enamel you see i get this um, kind of splitting color effect that i really really don't like and i didn't like this flower when i did it and i still don't <laughs> uh, but i will try to use <coughs> this mixture again and see what will happen so this one will stay end of the video it will change a little i will just clean this up a little bit 
and I have in I I don't know I will do a rack ring pour again and I will use this um, blue and orange and I will add some turquoise so we will see I have this bigger canvas <clears throat> it's a uh, 12 by 12 inches 30 by 30 centimeter and we will see let's grab our cup uh, what I want to have in the middle I probably want to have blues so as I said I have some turquoise and this is turquoise and iridescent pebeo iridescent blue green and I have this blue sapphire manganese blue and greenish blue and of course navy and some oranges so how what I want to have in the middle I want to have this navy I will not use the pearl white because I don't like the effect so, huh? so I started with <laughs> navy and no let's add this sapphire next consistency is totally different that I'm used to and some and greenish blue and the iridescent and I will add some of this greenish yellowish green and maybe Indian yellow next some cadmium orange and burnt Conequadon burnt orange and this orange red and I will add some of this reflex orange here too and let's throw some white this is just white it's not pearl white some blues again iridescent let's throw some green in here and turquoise this manganese and I will end up with navy again I don't know what will happen with these colors. They look nice in here, but I don't know how they will look here. <clears throat> so let's start. When I do this uh, red ring pours, I try to imagine what I want to achieve or if I want to have kind of chose what colors I will use and in which order so
Oop. So this is kind of what I was hoping for. <clears throat> and let's see. I kind of want to have this this one like it is and that part I will do I think so I will go that way and do kind of a spiral and I want to bring a little orange down here if I can just try to imagine what this will look like <clears throat> when you will take part so I want to leave it like it is I will not rag that one I will just rack a little bit here and let's tilt this and obviously I will lose a lot of my edge here because there is just too much of everything And I will try to keep some of this orange if I can. Obviously not. And I have something here I have to... You see? Because... This would ruin everything, so I lost a lot, almost all of my orange, so I don't like it. I want to have more orange. No, I don't like that part at all. So sorry, my connection was gone again. I hope that I'm back now. Please refresh your browsers if um, you lost me so what do you think should we do another ring on top or should we leave this i don't know i'm not completely sure what to do i just Think that I will just torch here just to I don't know maybe bring some orange dots out <laughs> from the air bubbles so I did get the little muddy thing here but it's not so bad I don't know it's kind of uh, underwater thing. But I'm not quite happy with this part. So what if I just try to tilt a little more to this side? I don't know.
and then I will go back I didn't do much I really don't like this corner here I have to tilt it off because it bothers me I don't know and I get this really strange looking cells I really don't know maybe with some exotic fish yes but I just don't know if I want to leave this. <laughs> Sometimes it's just so hard to decide. So I don't know how you decide when you want to stop or scrape or pour over or I don't know. I have troubles with this. I want to pour this off. Tilt this off, I have to say. Okay. I will leave it and I will see what will happen when it will be dry and maybe I will pour over. <laughs> you can pour over, so it's not... But I really like this cup, you see? It's beautiful. Sometimes cups are beautiful than pours. So I will move these paints to the side and grab my last canvas for today because I want to do just black and white and aside uh, I want to do a rack drink pour but I was thinking just to use just black and white and I couldn't decide if maybe I should throw some bronze gold into it or just leave it black and white I really want to see how this will work this ratting thing with only black and white what do you think should I use just black and white You see what a lovely navy <laughs> military green I get. So I can do some military themed pour. But can use this for just to flow, help your flow, paint flow. So Oop, I will change my gloves because I have paint over my... So I have this um, gallery wrapped canvas and I painted it with black because I will pour over some 
failed poor and what we decide should we use just black and white or should we throw some of this bronze gold into it Yes, I can use it for some green leaves. <clears throat> okay, most of you said that we should throw some gold in. And I want to have black center, so I will start with black. <gasps> My cup just broke. And white. And let's throw some bronze gold and black and white. Let's do some black and white again. <clears throat> Some bronze and some black white and black again and this should be it. I will just Pour some black here in the middle. Okay. I'm in frame. Yes, I am. Let's see what will happen with this one. And now I will have only my bronze. Where is my black and white? Here I lost my black and white. We will see when we will stretch this, how this will look. Let's wreck it. I hope that I will get a little black out because this is just too gold for me. Let's see, maybe I should pour some paint around. I don't have black anymore, so. We we'll have to pour some white around. I'll just try to wet my canvas a little bit just to make this paint flow a little easier, maybe. Okay. So, which way 
I want to go first. And I will not go over the edges yet. I will just try to stretch it a little bit first to see. And I definitely have a lot of air bubbles that is not happening with when I use my pouring medium, so it's just so weird for me. So I want to tilt this part off first. So I did get some black. <laughs> so weird. I can already see that I will have a lot of troubles because I don't have my pouring medium that I'm used to. Okay. Yes, it's a zebra. Ah, I don't like this part at all. So let's pour it off. And a little of this part. Okay. Maybe I have too much paint, I don't know. But I want to have my sides covered, not completely, but I have them covered quite a bit. I don't know, maybe this will look nice when it will dry because of this gold, but for now I really don't know and I have a lot of air bubbles that I don't know what will they will look like because they will pop and I will get this little... Do this... Um, you see, I don't get these things with my pouring medium, so I really, really don't know how this will dry. Uh, when I look uh, at my sides, I think that maybe I have too much paint that I should Tilt it a little more because sides I are quite nice or just some of them I will ooh, try to bring you a little closer. You see a lot of air bubbles. I don't know. It's totally zebra. <laughs> uh, whoop, sorry. Uh, but I will leave it because this gold, it looks uh, brown now, but uh, when it will be dry, it will be beautiful, I think. So I think that I will 
leave that one too but i still don't like the previous one uh and i will do one just with black and white one day and see what will happen because and maybe when i will get my pouring medium back i will do I will do one with uh, pearl medium, but today I don't want to use it because when I look at my first painting, when I use it, it really didn't <laughs> react like I hoped. So, uh, This is what I have in my mind for today. I just thinking uh, I don't have black anymore so I can't do it. Maybe on a little one. On a little canvas. Maybe we can try on one little one i will just put this one aside just to make some room whoops okay come here zebra i'm really curious how this one will dry Let me clean this a little bit. I will have to find um, a mixture, glue mixture too, that will work better because this one really didn't work as I hoped. I have so many air bubbles and I don't like that so okay and I don't have push pants in here in this one I will use reuse one of the canvases because it is an experiment again and I will use the one with set in enamel experiment that and pearl white that it didn't work so I will do some cloud pour this week with set in enamel not with mixture with my pouring um, with my pearl white so let's use this one no Thank you, Susan. Let's see. So here is my pearl white and black. And let's throw bronze into it. Just hope. Let's see how this will go. So I will use pearl white this time and not as much gold as I <laughs> had it last time maybe I should have used this cup with black paint mixed in because it's it's gone i hope that i will have enough paint for this little canvas but i want to see what will look with pearl white let's this is just white and I will just 
flood my canvas a little bit because I don't have a lot of paint. So I will just spread a little white here. Okay. Let's see what will happen. Now my pearl white takes over completely. See? <laughs> Let's just wreck it. Some weird shapes and see. Totally taking over. Pearl white, it's all the black and all the gold. So definitely just a little bit, not as much. I added too much of pearl white, obviously. But the effect is kind of neat. So maybe I can use it again, but way less. Then I use it here, but it's just an experiment again. So when you try it the first time, you never know how much of paint you have. Maybe some idea in your head, but you have to try, play with it and see what happens. So, see I lost all of my gold completely. It shows a little bit, a little, little, little bit. And maybe when this will be dry, it will be uh, better, but <laughs> it's just too much of my pearl white. So. It just looks white. Uh, I will torch this, but I'm afraid because of all this, this pearl white will react a little more. See how it looks into the cup. It's, it's almost like set in enamel effect, so. I really don't know what to do with this one. It just too, 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 I don't know. More than that, the rouge work. I don't have black anymore, so maybe let's try add some navy and a little of the pearl white, not as much, 
I have a lot of blues left, so let's do some blues. Green. And manganese blue. Greenish blue. Oh, I have just a little canvas and I already, oh, what I have in here, put so much paint. So let's see. I definitely have way too much paint. So here comes the pearl white. To wreck this because it's really not looking I don't know something like this part you see this uh, it's almost like a cloud effect oh I have a big blob of paint here I and I get violet from I don't know. See this block here. Just have to. So Too blurry or something, I don't know. But I will use it in this wrecked ring pores, I think. They almost look like it's glowing or something. I will when I will take you closer, you will see. You see? kind of interesting so I think that I will focus try again with uh, pearl white and wrecking greens so we will see how this will dry and now I will take you down for a close up just a second. Oh, let's do this one first. You see this effect? It's really, really 
interesting. I don't know if this if I can show you this on camera, but it's really interesting in in person. Uh, and let's go to the this one with blues and oranges. It's kind of underwater world. Maybe I will embellish this one. And here is our zebra. <laughs> we will see how this will dry. Uh, but it's not bad in person. You see all these lines are looking kind of 3d i just i will try to show you the sides see it looks okay i have to do something and the first one that it's so you lost me for a second probably different 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 reaction than with my pouring medium so I really I will probably be I will <laughs> try to get my Bessner binder again because I'm used to it and I probably have to turn turn my camera because I was and these lines here are nice and it looks kind of okay but not okay completely. Hello Linda. And this last one, and I like these effects. You see, the kinds of um, that you can look through it. So this is it for today. <laughs> we did some experiments. We will play some more these days with different pouring mediums because I don't have mine. Maybe I will even do some live in the middle of this week. We will see. So I hope that you will all stay safe and uh, well and that these weird times will pass quick and that we will have my our lives back. So thank you all for coming and see you on the next one. Bye.